Hello people, so boys, today I'm, I'm going to give you some tips before playing like these games, like these obby games over here. Today I'm playing Tower of Easy and it's as easy as can be. So, so Tower of Easy spe specifically goes on in like a path like this. So basically first thing you shift lock, shift lock actually, actually makes you go faster because if you actually don't use shift lock you become very stuck you become very stuck and there, there is a more and uh, yeah you're, you will go slower if you don't use shift lock people actually use it and then next tip okay so i fell down over there jump from the corner jumping from the corner gives you, an, gives you a small a small bit of time like give saves you like a millisecond or something but that will give you like Now, so let's see. Ne so yeah, I, so yeah, let's see. Like over here, what I did was I jumped all of the way to the other corner. There's actually this other person. Try, try specifically. Okay, then read always the, the caption of each stage because there is always a stage here, like snake as a as over there that the first stage is reactor and the second stage i didn't actually read it but reading it actually can save you a lot of time but basically that that is good so so yeah then then so in tower, in tower of easy actually if you don't av actually if you avoid Okay, this woman here thinks that she's playing Tower of... Okay. <laughs> okay so yeah okay this is a trick that everybody knows in, t in toe so so basically you can actually jump from here i, I basically don't prefer using shift back on this one this one gives you a speed advantage over the others and will save you a, a little bit of time over there okay this is like new world right good thing those are white if you touch the white stuff uh, they actually don't kill you it's actually not so yeah so yeah this person here thinks that is is a youtuber and i, I say that she said she is actually a clickbait because that isn't toh toh is another game with like seven seven stages seven stages i think five stages tower of dread is five stages and tower of easy three stages so yeah this Tower of Easy is actually a bit of a preparation, so, so if you can be first, be first. So this is pads. So basically, so basically, don't try to be parkour in your first time. If, try to figure out who you are. Basically, if you, basically, look. If I touch this, it actually won't kill me. It's, it just, it's, it's actually just. Guess 666. <gasps> oh my god. Yes. No. Okay, so give small advices to anybody, but yeah, if the people here are toxic, just just don't give them advices. So so yeah, figure yourself out if you're So basically if if you're a slow if you're if you like doing things slow like okay I didn't if you like doing things slow like like you're a you, you like leave you, you're like a bit clumsy 
and you want to figure yourself out and we, everybody will see if you're a fast dude you, you're basically you, you're basically a speedrunner and you like speedrunning these these easy games this I I preferably am half speedrunner and half clumsy and, I mean it's true I'm half speedrunner and half clumsy I'm not that good at these games I'm actually a little bit clumsy so so yeah so yeah I'm actually in the lead right now so so that is the advantage of, of being quick Num then if if you can if, if if you're AFK make sure to be at the top or even POD POD like the game okay this is this Get up. Oh, ho, ho. So basically, I'm half speedrun and half clumsy. I basically. And then discover new tips and new directions. This will actually help you. So, boys, that that's it for today. Serious the Great. Serious the Great. Serious the Great here. I'm out of here. Peace.